USC Upstate picks up an opening victory in the series with FGCU, 7-3. The late offense had been their Achilles heel across the course of the Atlantic Sun Conference season this year. Tonight they turned the tables. A four-run seventh marched by a three-run home run from Cody Britton propels upstate to victory. Let's take a look back at the highlights from this one. Tom started with a good outing from Tyler Jackson and Brian Hathaway solid as well. They were good on the mound, good defensively, and you'll see some timely hits. Yeah, the Eagles got on the board first uh, with the base hit there and led one nothing. How would Upstate respond? Well, they would come back a little bit later on and do a nice job. And also defense was the key. How about Cody Britton here in the throw home? Yeah, he's going to gun down a runner. Proved to be huge in the game. Kept us where we were as we made our way into the seventh inning in a 3-3 contest. Think about this too, Tom. Bottom of the order in this game on both sides. Hitters at the bottom of the order, absolutely phenomenal. That's where the offense came from alongside that defense we were talking about. Well, put that ball in play too. You see Shemko there and a bad throw that bounces away. And Jordan Miller will score in a moment. Then Fickus puts it down. And you know, when you put it in play, some good things can happen. And Upstate able to take advantage of it in the beginning. That's the case with small balls. You see that be effective in the four run bottom of the seventh for Upstate here. Sometimes it's just a big yeah. swing of the bat. Cody Britton had it. Well, it was a good time to do that. Uh, it's been a long time waiting to break out a little bit uh, for Upstate and able to do that effectively here tonight. Seven runs on 11 hits for the Spartans. You see the overall numbers. Four big errors for FGCU jump off the page at you as well. Yeah, that opened the door and took advantage of that. Uh, that's the key, being able to take advantage of that, and Upstate did tonight. Hathaway gets the win. He was solid in relief. The loss goes to Anderson, drops to 5-5. Five and five. Hathaway, a 2-0 and oh for the young man so far on the year. No save was required in a game that took around 237 here on this Friday night. We remind you, tomorrow, 2 p.m., Tom and Phil will be here with the call. We'll also have Sunday's game, the finale, all three on ESPN3. But when all is said and done here on this night, the Spartans make it three in a row at home. They get back in the win column in Atlantic Sun Conference play with a 7-3 victory over the Eagles of FGCU.